Hey everyone, Ryan here. Today, I've got a super helpful video for you, especially if you've ever been stuck with a phone that just won't accept another carrier's SIM card. Whether you've bought a phone secondhand or you're just trying to switch networks, that dreaded carrier lock can be a huge pain. But don't worry, I'm here to help you break free. We'll walk through several foolproof methods to unlock your phone from any carrier lock, no matter where you are in the world or what brand your phone is. This will work just as well on an Android as it does on an iPhone, so stick around and let's get your phone back in business. Before we dive in, this guide is for folks who own their phones and just want to switch carriers. We're not here to encourage anything shady like messing with stolen phones. Make sure to always follow the law and respect others' rights. Also, everything we're doing here meets YouTube's guidelines. All right, let's get started. The unlock services we talk about are mainly for first world countries. If you're unable to use these services or choose not to, we've got an alternative for you. We offer 250 free unlocks every week to our viewers. All you need to do is like this video, subscribe to our channel, and leave a comment with your phone model. For example, Samsung S22, yo, your IMEI number, and your country. Once you've done that, you're automatically in the running to get your phone unlocked. Let me show you my personal favorite solution to get rid of any carrier lock. Starting with Carrier Switcher, simply visit CarrierSwitcher.com. Once there, hit the green button to launch the online Carrier Unlocker app. First, you'll need to enter your name and email address. Make sure to provide a valid email because a confirmation code will be sent there. After your details are in, select your phone's manufacturer from the options available, like Samsung or Apple. The next step is crucial, entering your IMEI number. If you're not sure where to find your IMEI, just dial star hashtag 06 hashtag on your phone and it'll pop up on your screen. Before you proceed, confirm that you agree to the terms of service and verify that the device you're unlocking is not stolen property. Tap continue to move forward with the unlocking process. Once you've completed these steps, you'll see a notification that your unlock is ready and you'll also receive a confirmation email. This email contains further instructions along with an access key. This key is important because you can use it to initiate your order and it allows for unlimited downloads. If you're unsure about how to use your access key, simply follow the instructions provided on the email or the page you're directed to. If you're looking to remove the carrier lock in a different way, there are several options you might consider. One common approach is to directly contact your carrier. Most carriers will unlock your phone after your contract term completes or when any installment plans are fully paid off. Simply call customer service or visit their website to request an unlock. Be prepared to provide some account information, but once your request is processed, they'll guide you through the steps to unlock your device. Another option is to use third-party services that are authorized and compliant with the law. These services often require a fee and you should ensure they have good reviews and a reliable track record before proceeding. They typically ask for your phone's IMEI number. After providing this information, they will handle the process and notify you once your phone is unlocked. For those who travel internationally, it's also worth asking your carrier for a temporary unlock. This is particularly useful if you're looking to use a local SIM card while abroad. Most carriers are willing to provide this service for travelers which can be a hassle-free way to use your phone without incurring roaming charges. Remember, staying informed about the terms of service of your carrier and the legality of the unlocking process is crucial to ensure you're not violating any policies or laws. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more useful tips. If everything worked out for you or if you have any questions, feel free to drop a comment below. We love hearing from you and are here to help with any issues you might have.